Hello everybody. Today we are going to be looking into some old, old tea. Um, but I haven't looked into it very much before. There was a rumour, and I don't believe a rumour, I'm just saying, that William and Kate had problems with an extramarital person. This was in the foreign press. Um, I have never picked up anything like that in all of my readings, and I do read on the royal family quite a lot, that this is true. I just want to say that starting off. So I want to know why this rumour happened, what happened with it, and why it's out there, or was out there. Um, and just have a little bit of a nose around that question and see what the tarot cards have to say about that, allegedly, of course, for entertainment purposes only. But before I begin... If you're new here, hi, please consider subscribing, leaving a like and sharing. If you've been here for a while, thank you so much for all your support. I do appreciate you guys a lot. We do have a new thing called the Emotional Support Coven. And it's £2.99 a month to join the Emotional Support Coven. And you get extra tarot readings, um, behind the scenes video and a members only live chat once a month. Um, so yeah. Check the comments because there's a competition as well. I've pinned a comment probably down below. So have, have a look at that and then the community post for the November 2022. And yeah, so let us begin and have a look around this rumour. Just put my little friend there. Let's have a look. Okay, you want to come out? What are you? <laughs> you know where this is going, guys, don't you? Okay, so some people who left and went overseas. Sometimes the tarot is just so... And we're really... This is somebody stirring the pot from overseas, allegedly for entertainment purposes only. They did leave to become overseas, but yeah. Okay. What is known about the situation? This is sometimes the cards are just injustice. It wasn't fair. It's not right. It was cruel and unnecessary. It was out of balance. Um, and they used this to as a sign of frustration and pettiness and anger, they wanted to start something new. And it's kind of like undermine, trying to undermine people's um, people's legal ties to other people. So that could be unions of marriage, contracts, whatever. This is, this is just cruelty. Oh my Lord, hey. Why did they do this? Because they felt attacked. They wanted, they are being on the defensive, on shaky ground all the time, and they lashed out about this. They really did lash out about this. So these overseas people did plant these rumours by the looks of things. Sometimes the cards are just zoop direct very quick i don't know what that zoop noise was but it's there uh, fall from glory fall from grace somebody's wounded ego really did this now i really do feel what's coming through to me when i saw that card i would say that this wasn't necessarily the lady who's overseas. This is definitely coming allegedly for entertainment purposes only from a gentleman overseas. He feels undermined. And this is probably before, this, this is when it was before they went. Uh, 
and now we have the devil so we have the six of and the seven of six of wands and the seven of wands in reverse we have the ace of wands and the six of swords and we have justice in reverse and then we have the devil coming up so it was about jealousy control manipulation lies What they wanted to was cause a split, a but there was an also a split within the um the family as well. So this could be like a friendship ended situation, but it's also they wanted to create a rupture a childhood split. So I feel this is personal more between the brothers than it is Because we've got the Six of cup there, Cups there and the Two of Cups. I really feel like this is something personal in the Brothers. With the Six of Cups, that is um, going back to childhood, harking back to childhood rumours. There's a rupture here. There's a rupture with how he thinks. I think it's almost like this is very jealous, petty kind of energy there. And it's kind of wanting to go in and... Things didn't go quite well with this rumour as they wanted. They may regret it, actually. Because we've got the seven we've got sorry, we've got the eight of swords there, and they feel really they, it was difficult to get out of something. They got tied up in their own words and maybe they got caught out with it and they regret it. That's interesting. Now let me just see how William and Kate felt about the rumours. This is just awful. <clears throat> it does look like there's been a massive kind of split with them. And I mean with the brothers. They felt there was a risk. And they felt like their boundaries had been crossed. They felt foolish to trust them. They felt foolish to have them around. They have grew impatient with him. Yeah. And it... These rumours hurt them and it unsettled them because of the split here. Now, this is all pre-Megxit, remember? Just before Megxit. The Four of Wands, undermining foundation, undermining happiness. The Nine of Pentacles, there's Kate. Wealthy, happy, upright. There's Megxit. There's Control. So they really felt like hurt by this situation. The boundaries were crossed. They were impatient about it. They felt stumped about it. They couldn't turn around and tell out their their um their you know, they couldn't turn around and say, actually, you've gone too far with this boundary this unfair judgment that's happening with me i can't reset that they couldn't turn around and say that we've got the nine of pentacles there which is um the very demure earth sign woman looking wealthy rich happy and this is why they did it jealousy because of her the four of swords there we go <clears throat> with the grief and the four of swords i think something was actually said around these rumors at the funeral and there we have william in a positive and kate in a positive as well they were upset by these rumors they were frustrated by these rumors they felt undermined by these rumors and it did cause some hurt and upset within the family. 
Meghan and Harry, or the overseas couple, then did leave because they were trying to cause division. They were trying to cause splits. Um, it was all about control. And there was frustration because this is something that they felt like they couldn't control. They didn't understand where it was coming from, but they got cute to it. Now, something came out around the time of the Queen's funeral, allegedly for entertainment purposes only. And with the King of Cups there and the Queen there, I do feel the Queen, Catherine, Princess of Wales there. I do feel like they sussed them out. This was very much, yeah. It was targeted at Catherine. It was targeted to undermine Catherine. But Williams, I feel like, said something and put things right. And that's why the overseas couple may say regret saying it. With the devil there, though, it's a very spiteful thing. Hmm. I don't know if you're mentioning it as a book or not. Feel Prince William's cute to them. But yeah, okay. The met this rumour may have well been stopped, stopped. Do not feel there's any truth in it at all. The cards say there's no truth in it. And it was upsetting for everybody who was at the end of it. Probably the whole family quite upset. It did disturb people. And I think this is where maybe William and Catherine were onto her quicker, onto them quicker about Mexico and everything, maybe than Prince Charles and things like King Charles and everything like that. It, it took him more of a time, I think, to realise. But there we go. Let me know what you think of the cards down below. Let me know if there's anything you want to add, anything you want to take away. Um, thank you very much for being here. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everyone.